At least 20 villagers have been killed in Niger in series of attacks by motorcycle bandits. The country's interior minister, Bonsu Mohammed, who visited the scene of the tragedy in Tilabiri, debunked the killings. He also announced a robust security measure to be implemented as violence in the region resurged. They came by motorcycle. But we didn't know how many they were. They divided into small groups and surrounded our village. One group went directly to the well, where they killed three people in cold blood. And another group went to the south side, where they killed a nurse and two other people. So far, we have responded to these violence with strategies that were not sustainable. But with increase in violence, and the level of violence we have seen so far, we are advancing plans to implement very strict measures to deter the perpetrators of those heinous crimes and to bring them to justice. In January, the authorities restricted the circulation of motorcycles in a bid to clamp down jihadist operating in the region. The state of emergency, which was first established in 2017, was then extended with a mobilization of nearly 5,000 foreign soldiers as part of the ongoing operation Beckon.